The immune system is the most complex and powerful weapon we have to fight disease. It has evolved over millions of years to protect us against invasion, and the battle against intruders still rages on. Humans won a major victory when we learned to train the immune system. With the help of vaccines, we can recognize and neutralize threats. For the first time in history, more people are dying from chronic diseases than from infection. But why should we admit defeat there? Chronic diseases are the enemy we are now trying to combat, a health risk arising from cells or proteins within our own body. Because these threats are parts of our living bodies, our immune system wants to avoid generating antibodies against them. But scientists discovered we could bypass this safeguard by producing antibodies outside of the patient, then injecting or infusing them. These monoclonal antibodies are helping us successfully fight against chronic diseases, including arthritis, psoriasis, lupus, migraine, high cholesterol, and even some forms of cancer. Unfortunately, this weapon isn't available to everybody. Monoclonal antibodies are difficult to make and difficult to take. Massive bioreactors are needed to produce enough to treat only a fraction of those in need, and the drugs are extraordinarily expensive. The average cost of a monoclonal antibody medication in the US is around $100,000 per year. Vaccinity wants to make the fight against chronic diseases more equal, so preventing chronic diseases could become a democratic right for many instead of the privilege of a few. Vaccinity's technology uses small amino acid chains called peptides, which act as a sheep in wolf's clothing, allowing the body to recognize a dangerous endogenous molecule as a threat. One part of the vaccine helps to sound the alarm to the immune system without causing inflammation. The other part presents a blueprint for the necessary antibodies to our body's antibody factory. This way, we are able to engineer a highly specific antibody response to a particular target. Unlike monoclonal antibodies, peptide vaccines are inexpensive to produce and require very small amounts to elicit an antibody response. After promising use in animal health, Vaccinity has now developed vaccine candidates for human diseases that have successfully completed multiple clinical trials. This technology may enable us to vaccinate against chronic diseases including Alzheimer's, Parkinson's, migraine and many more. With the help of this technology, we could carry off another victory in the fight against disease. Using vaccines against infections was the first step. Now we may also be able to address the chronic threats afflicting the global population, democratizing health through accessible medicine for all.